So big news today, obviously, Elon Musk buys 9 plus percent of Twitter, and those shares are up over 20 percent. So we did a live video to show our hero signal, uh, and our hero signal shows the hedging impact of real-time options. And if you watch that video, it's on the screen here. I will put it in the description for this video. But basically, it shows you the hedging impact in real time of all the options flow. So as calls come in, we are monitoring essentially the deltas that are trading tied to the, all of that flow. And we believe that that can have an impact on the stock. So you can watch uh, that video. Again, it'll be linked. But basically what you can see here is the end of day flow for Twitter. And in the orange, we have the call flow. So this is only the flow from call trades. And the idea here is that if the orange line is trending higher, that is telling us that traders are buying calls and that is eliciting uh, dealer hedging in the form of buying the stock. And what we really wanted to point out is that as this indicator goes higher, uh, the stock we believe should react in kind and track this options flow. So in this case, we had very powerful, very strong options flow off the start. And then once this line or indicator trades uh, or turns sideways, excuse me, that is telling us that the flow is slowing down or ceasing, right? Um, so we have big buying here and then it turns neutral. And what you can see is that after the flow turns neutral, and you can see that's after the flow turns neutral, the stock trades a little bit sideways. This is a very big block trade that went up. Uh, so you have to kind of discount this as it likely went through a bank desk or something where they hedge it out. And then you can see that the flow seems to turn back on into the afternoon. And with that, the stock goes higher. Now, as the stock broke 50, the call flow turned to sellers. And you can tell it's selling because this indicator goes lower. So the fact that the orange line, which is the call line, is going lower, that's telling us traders are selling calls uh, in, in Twitter, excuse me. And we believe that that would then pressure the stock lower or release some of that built up call energy, so to speak, um, in the name and the stock actually mean reverts at that point. So it's a very good day for Tesla. Very big options volume, obviously. On the put side, there was some light put selling in the morning and then it just traded sideways basically for the rest of the day. So it wasn't that many people tried to buy puts in uh, Twitter. That kind of makes sense because the implied volatility was so high. Uh, it's been jacked up so much now that if you're buying a put and the stock comes down, it's likely that the implied volatility is going to go down as well. So you could lose money here by buying a put unless you're directionally very right. Uh, so the odds are not really tilted in your favor there uh, to be a put buy here just because that elevated implied volatility. So we hope that this helps explain sort of some of the action and price action in Twitter. If you're interested in trying out uh, the uh, hero for in real time for yourself you can go to spotgamma.com and you click subscribe now and you can try our alpha subscription for free for seven days